It's just like the uh, the Flor the Florida deal. Yep. Flo Florida is still part owner of Celsius. Yeah. He even said after the the lawsuit that he wants to continue promoting the brand. Well, uh, let's continue to see what what else uh, Ernie Leisure has to say about this. He still has a large stake in the company, like I said, 24.9%, if he did, yeah. right? So they still have the majority. But now Bacardi owns 75.1% of Duce. Or they'd be worth in eight years off of his name. Right. Or if the numbers show, like he, they settled at $3 billion, allegedly or reportedly, but what if it was five? Or seven. Or se right. And we know during the Depression, alcohol consumption goes up. They're still going to use his likeness in some way to promote the brand. Mm -hmm. I would not be surprised if that brand in four or five years isn't worth 12 or $13 billion. And all of a sudden, there was some kind of accounting error to value it at 1.5 or 1.7. Yeah. And I'm sure he's going to promote it, right? It's not like he still doesn't have ownership in it. Yeah. Right? We, we At the brunch, Ducey is sponsoring it. Yeah. Right? So the brand will live on. Obviously, you know, his it's just like the uh, the Flor the Florida deal. Yep. Flo Florida is still part owner of Celsius. Yeah. He even said after the the lawsuit that he wants to continue promoting the brand. Of course. I mean, you're part owner, so you should want the best for your money. You business is yeah. Yeah. Continue. Yeah, business is business, so. You just, why would you step on the company that you still own? For, you know, sense. you partially still own. So, yeah. 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 That, I agree with you, man. It doesn't make any sense to be emotional and all that stuff. I mean, business is business. You got to keep making money and you keep promoting. Got to make that. That seven hundred fifty million you have left in the stake in the company, you gotta make it a billion. Yeah, at least. At least. I mean, if it goes to twelve uh, twelve billion dollar valuation in a couple of years, then that would mean that he has how much? Three, one. So one, he two, would still have twenty five percent of three billion. Yeah. You see, I can count. <laughs> Uh, you started, you started, and then you, you had it right, so. I calculated it first. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, man. dude. Yeah, oh, just... man. Let's see. Let's see what else, what else the guys at Ernie Lisa have to say about this. It's, he still has a stake. He's, he's a, an owner, so why wouldn't you promote it? It, it still generates revenue for you. That's tricky, though, because, like, I hate when these valuation games get played with us in particular. Mm -hmm. And I guarantee in a year, they're going to reevaluate the company is going to be worth a hell of a lot more. Yeah, but that, and so shout out and again, kudos to Jay and the whole team, right? So if you look at it, last year, they made the move with LVMH. Yeah. So Ace of Spade to have, yeah. be part of that luxury company. And we saw the numbers that that did. And so do say was something that kind of was birthed after that. But you can know, I mean, that's a big, that's still a win. That's still a big win, yeah. Yeah, but, I don't want black entrepreneurs to get lower valuations mm -hmm. and then matters valued at what it's worth. And if I have to ask you who's the more impactful CEO, Jay-Z or Mark Zuckerberg, I'm going with Jay every time. Let Jay have that slot at Meta for two years and let's see what it does. I know what it would do. Well, impact. Absolutely. Like, the, relift the Instagram, relift the Facebook, all the content. It would be dramatically different. So, like, I hate that they devalue what the brand was really worth. Yeah. But don't get me wrong, seven fifty is a win. That's on a conservative low end. Yeah, right. But I mean, again, you want to do something great. True greatness is can you do it twice? You did it with Ace of Speed. That's true. Now I did it with Duce. Yeah. What's to say you can't do it again? But should you have to? No. Yeah. But you could. Yeah. Shout out to Hove. Yeah. Anything you want to say about that? The last part? Uh, it's clear. I'm more interested in seeing what uh, Jay-Z's next move will be. <laughs>